Hi, this is Anna and welcome to another video from Snob Monkey. Today's topic is how AI is being used in warfare and propaganda. The nature of war is changing rapidly before our very eyes. Propaganda is evolving at an unprecedented rate and at the center of it all is artificial intelligence. From autonomous drones executing complex maneuvers to AI-generated fake news spreading like wildfire, warfare today is fought with code, not just bullets. In this video, we uncover the chilling truth about how AI is reshaping modern conflict and how propaganda has gone digital, data-driven, and disturbingly real. AI is now capable of making kill decisions without human approval. These are known as Autonomous Weapons Systems, or AWS. They can identify targets, lock on, and fire, all within seconds. Turkey's cargo drone allegedly made its first autonomous strike in Libya. That's not science fiction, that's history. AI-powered surveillance now tracks entire cities. It can scan thousands of faces, monitor heat signatures, and predict movement patterns. In China, this system is used to suppress dissent. In Israel, it's used to target enemy combatants. In both, it's AI deciding what's suspicious. AI doesn't need bombs or bullets. It just needs bandwidth and clever code. From smart malware that adapts in real time, learning as it goes, to AI phishing that mimics your boss's tone perfectly, cyber warfare is now automated and increasingly sophisticated. Governments around the globe are actively building AI tools designed to attack power grids, stock exchanges, and even critical infrastructure, without a single soldier ever needing to cross a physical border. AI can now generate fake news videos of world leaders saying things they never said. These deep fakes can spark protests, incite violence, or destroy reputations. During the Russia-Ukraine conflict, deepfakes of both Zelensky and Putin circulated online, each pushing different narratives, and millions watched, not knowing what was real. AI bots flood platforms like Twitter, Facebook and TikTok with pro-war messages, conspiracy theories and propaganda, all on autopilot. They mimic humans, respond like humans, and manipulate public opinion at scale. These aren't just trolls. They're tools of state-sponsored psychological warfare. AI analyses what you click, like, and fear. It builds a psychological profile and delivers propaganda tailored just for you. Micro-targeting turns citizens into ideological weapons. You don't even know you're being manipulated. Israel's AI program, The Gospel, reportedly selected airstrike targets in Gaza. China's AI tracks Uyghur Muslims with facial recognition, and the US Pentagon's Project Maven uses AI to analyze drone footage for military operations. These aren't pilots. These are algorithms deciding who lives and who dies. Who's to blame if an autonomous drone bombs the wrong building? If a deep fake incites riots? If propaganda triggers war? AI isn't evil, but it's fast, unpredictable and unstoppable once deployed. There are calls for AI arms treaties, for deepfake bans, for transparency in autonomous weapons. But progress is slow, and AI moves fast. Some countries are banning facial recognition, others are scaling it up. There is no global consensus, only a digital arms race. AI offers incredible potential. It can be used to deliver aid efficiently, detect conflict before it erupts, and ultimately save lives across the globe. But we must also acknowledge that in the wrong hands, this powerful technology will inevitably be used to divide, deceive, and even destroy. The fundamental question is not simply what AI do, but rather what we as a society allow it to become. What do you think? Comment below and let me know your thoughts and perspectives on this critical issue. See you in the next video.